as we check out your forecast on this Thursday, I'm meteorologist Cindy O'Quinn, the UF Weather Center, and our three big things we're talking about is the below normal temperatures that are continued not only from today, but all the way into next week. More rain as a wave enhances our chance of rain on Friday, particularly Friday afternoon, Friday night. And then our first freeze is what we're talking about. That's expected on Sunday morning. Now, as we're checking out our temperatures for Friday, we're going to be dropping down to a morning low of 48 degrees. So it's going to be pretty chilly. We will see some of the scattered showers. Uh, sun will be up around 711, but you won't see very much of it. But I want to point out on the temperature map something pretty interesting. You see the uh, lower 50s on I-10 corridor, mid 50s around the Gainesville area, Bronson over to Cross City. And then notice down a little bit to the south, 64 Acala and 68 the villages in 70 Daytona. That is to the south of the cold front boundary. But then watch what happens as we jump forward into Saturday. You're going to see those temperatures then dropping off as that front passes through the entire area. And we all see temperatures then into the mid, uh, middle 50s and lower 50s. But here it is, the frontal boundary for this evening. We're going to be seeing some more of those spotty showers and that rainfall will become widespread at times during the overnight hours. But really the best chance will be we'll see some spotty activity on Friday. And then notice as we get into the later afternoon hours and particularly Friday night as that wave passes by, we're looking at some heavier rain and more steady rain. Now Saturday morning a little bit left, but we'll clear out the rain showers pretty quickly. And then behind it, we will start to see some clearing skies, so a little bit of sun peeking through before sunset. And then into Sunday morning, that colder air continues to come down with that frontal boundary, another cold front. So it's going to be well below average with our first freeze and expected on Sunday morning. You see that jet stream is taking that dip straight down into central Florida. So you will have to take some precautions for your tender plants and trees. The next six days, here they are. We have more rain on Friday, though the heaviest will be later in the day towards Friday night and then a little bit left over on Saturday. So sort of cold and rainy there. We're looking at our first freeze then on Sunday and then the milder trend as we're starting into Monday.